sitaogopa cover by Anita Rioba uh, originally done by Joyce Omondi uh, anaitwa Anita Rioba karibu sana Asante uko fit yes me look uko sawa kabisa unakaa poa <laughs> you're welcome uh, umekuwa umekuwa kifanya covers mm -hmm. uh, mbona uliamua ku kuanza na covers before maybe you go to your own compositions because najua you're working on something yeah. mbona uliamua kuanza na covers kwanza Oh, okay. Na cover ni nini? Kuna mtu maybe ana watch but anachojua <laughs> cover ina maanisha nini? Cover. Mm -hmm. Okay, a cover is basically um the fan made. Mm -hmm. So if you maybe for me if I really like a song, mm -hmm. I can do my own version of the original oh, that particular song. Yes. Mm -hmm. So why I started doing covers? Um I think everybody has their own individual roots they follow. Ah, yeah. Kuna yeah. mm -hmm. watu na that first hit song mm -hmm. and then they go immediately to mm -hmm. doing more and more. But I guess for me it was choosing like these levels to mm -hmm. to every It was a starting point for you. Yeah, that mm -hmm. was where I chose to start mm -hmm. with the favorites that I'm familiar with mm -hmm. before I get to find my own okay. place like yeah. where I stand mm -hmm. musically but what was your foundation when first did you discover I have this gift of singing uh, I think that was primary school mm -hmm. and it wasn't me who actually it was me fooling around mm -hmm. and then uh, my folks going like oh you can you sing something. yeah uh -huh. so that was around uh, early primary mm -hmm. yeah and you've talked about your your folks how was it for for you cuz okay kuna kuna wazazi most of the time ukiambia unataka kufanya muziki reaction yao inakuwa tofauti sana wanakuambia we are not sure we want you to go that direction because mm -hmm. right now i know you're balancing you're balance, you're balancing school na music pia so reaction yao ilikuwaaje wakati sasa waliona kabisa uko you seriously want to go into it have they been supportive to you yeah mm -hmm. it's actually it's surprising for me they are the ones who are more insistent than my nature ko <laughs> enda fanya <laughs> so yeah. it was it was them mm -hmm. mm. okay and umesema umesema kuna favorites ya songs zile unafanya mm -hmm. so how do you choose in your in your cover nitafanya at a particular time because songs ni nyingi mm. how do you choose which which cover to do for me it depends on season mm -hmm. Because if you listen carefully to the covers I do, yeah. it'll be me speaking about something during a specific time. Mm -hmm. Like Sito Gopa was in 2020 yes. when everything was crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then the COVID and everything. Yeah, mm -hmm. here again came after that. So mm -hmm. it was like God Sasa to to pate kwa hii place and you took whatever has happened yeah. has happened. Mm -hmm. So where's the road from here? Then we got to Nenolako, mm -hmm. which was telling us to depend on what God has to yeah. say for us yeah. and sticking by it. Mm -hmm. Then now we have the, the other one, the which is... The one that we launched today. Yes, mm -hmm. Atafanya Njia, yeah. showing that we depend, we hear God's word, we, we listen to it, we, we read it, but we have to know that he's actually a God who follows through that mm -hmm. word, so he'll make a way. All right. Yeah. And uh, as much as you're doing covers, you're moving into releasing your own original compositions. Mm -hmm. So how is that for you? How is, because I know you have a few things maybe jotted down, you're trying to put them together in studio. Mm -hmm. How is that writing process for you and inspiration in Atoka Wapi? Um, for me, writing, <laughs> comes it didn't come very naturally mm -hmm. but i'll say it's just maybe something that i follow through personally it's those small like there's there's times i'd think uh, i'll write in this one session mm -hmm. but it comes in bits and pieces right. so for me it's something something small that i'll get and then i'll find ah oh, this this sounds good mm -hmm. so i'll put it together but it's really um me story like Christianity through the lens of Anita. Ah, if I can put interesting. It that way. Yes. All right, and today we are talking about uh, prayer and the importance or the benefits of uh, living a prayerful life. Mm. So, what what part has uh, prayer played in your life? Um, what does prayer mean to you? Oh, okay. That's a theme we've actually had mm -hmm. this week. Ah, Yesterday we were actually talking about church. prayer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, for me, I'd say I take it as um, the energy I, I I need, that personal conversation I'll have with God mm -hmm. in the morning, those two words I'm going to whisper. Um, I can say that beyond your 
ni kitu yenye imeniweka sana because mm -hmm. even home we come from a very Prayer prayerful form. background mm -hmm. so prayers definitely work and mm -hmm. do wonders for me all right yeah. and uh you have a new cover out actually you may release like an hour or so ago mm. Uh, <laughs> ago actually, yeah. Okay, just uh, to be briefly about it and uh, where guys can find your music mm -hmm. and your different social media platforms, then we'll go for a short break and come back with the performance. Okay, yeah. so Atafanya Njia is actually a song by my friend, like mm -hmm. somebody I know yes, personally. personally, she's in t Tanzania. Mm -hmm. So um, when I first listened to this song, all I had was peace. Mm -hmm. Like I couldn't stop record, like listening to it over time and, and again. Mm -hmm. So for Atafanya Njia, it's basically an encouragement, like, okay, there's this going on, yeah. there's that going on, there's this, you, there's this thing you're waiting on God for, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but at the end of the day, he's a God who follows through his word. Kabisa. So what I'd want to put out through that cover is mjue tu, yani kuna mungu mwenye ako apo, mm -hmm. he knows, yeah. he hears, and he'll make he'll a way. He'll make a way. Yeah. All right. Where can guys find you and your music? Uh, I am on IG, mm -hmm. I am on YouTube, mm -hmm. my music is mostly on YouTube, mm -hmm. I'm new to Facebook, mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> okay. trying to figure out that word, okay. and also Twitter. Twitter, Pia. Yes. Kwa umbali. Mm. Anaitu Anita Ryoba, so make sure you follow her and support her. Her music is on YouTube, her channel is Anita Ryoba, make sure you subscribe, uh, leave a like and a comment, show her some love. Right now we go for a short commercial break, uh, when we come back she'll be performing her.